So guys, you want to head over to this screen. So to get into this screen, you want to turn off your computer or your laptop from the power button and then turn it back on again three times. Once you turn off your computer and turn it back on, and you see the Windows loading screen, which I'm going to show you how it looks like right now, then you want to turn off your computer again. You want to repeat this three times. Turn it on, turn it off again, every single time you see the Windows loading screen, which will then bring you to this screen, after you do it three times. So now once you're on this screen, you want to click on Troubleshoot, Advanced Options, and we have a bunch of tools here that we can use. So for the first method, we're going to click on System Restore, and then you want to click on Next, if you have a Restore Point available. Click on your Restore Point and then click on Next, and then you want to go to your Restore Point. And then it should fix your problem. If you do not have a restore point available, then we're going to cancel this. And we're going to click on troubleshoot again and click on advanced options. Now for the second method, you want to click on startup repair. It's going to diagnose your PC and then see if it fixes your problem. Now hopefully that fixes your problem. But if not, then we're going to head back into this screen. You want to click on troubleshoot, advanced options, command prompt. Now once we're in here, we're going to type in sfc space forward slash scan now and then click on enter. Then you want to run this scan.